Okay, so rija kita rin sa aton nga special unit which is ang aton nga master guide emblem. Okay, so ang meaning sa aton nga master guide emblem, let's go first sa colors gyapot. Okay? Kung so, sa, sa colors, it means we have the, generally, we have the blue and the gold. For of course, the first is ang blue which is loyalty gyapon but sa master guide ng emblem we have that deeper thought okay ang loyalty which means it is the purpose of the master guide club teaching us to be loyal first we have our god in heaven ang uh, ikarwa which is aton nga family kagang ikatatlo ang aton nga simbahan Okay, so blue stands for loyalty with a deeper thought of these three. The purpose to be to us to be loyal to our God, to our family, and to our church. Okay, so next is ang gold or ang yellow. Uh, it's about excellence. Now, excellence, uh, the same with the pathfinder, but ang gold or ang yellow sa my uh, master guide program or ang atan nga master guide emblem as a deeper thought as well excellence in terms of um, the master guide club has a high standard to help build effective christian leaders dependent on god in order to complete the mission and return to our heavenly home so in the hambal kay tungod nga master guide kita uh, sige, uh, dyan lang gid kita pirmi sa may kilid. Yes, we are always there, the backup kita gid pirmi ang maging, we need to be servant leaders. But one thing is for sure, we have a high standard of excellence. It's because naga-create kita kang leaders. That is why we need to help build effective Christian leaders to have that kind of excellence no hindi lang kay tanod nga ado hindi ako fit to be leader but what is to be a master guide we learn ourselves even maski even if ma invest rin kita we still need to learn and learn and learn to have that kind of high standard to create more effective christian leaders okay so Next is ang atan nga six stars. Okay, we have six stars. Uh, three at the top, three at the bottom. It means the six AY classes, of course. We have friend, companion, explorer, ranger, voyager, and guide. No? Uh, amura ang atan nga nasa silin. But it doesn't mean nga ang AY classes only produces sa pathfinder from friend to guide. Hindi man natin in-neglect kay, of course, we are going to be master guides or we are already master guides. Hindi natin in-neglect ang Adventurers Club. no? So, sa Adventurers Club, we have the Little Lambs, Eager Beavers, BCBs, Sunbeams, um, Builders, and Helping Hands. no? So, hindi natin rin nga puntanda in-neglect na klase sa class because of course they are one of the most important things because as early as their stage they learn what is the importance of pathfindering and also as early as uh, their age are they know what is the meaning of christian leadership and also christian uh, growth or spirit uh, in our spiritual growth no okay we have the world, no, at the globe, oval. Our world is the the emblem, okay, is about missionary field, no. Missionary field, the master guide program origins are in the missionary volunteer society, okay. The emblem of a hemisphere of the world with the letters M V. Overlaid on it is a symbol of the purpose and goals of the Missionary Volunteer Society, which was to spread the Advent message throughout the entire world. So, Amore and no, it's our missionary field. It's not just on one place. Amore no nga, Amoja Kanami sa Master Guide Club. We don't just stay in one place. 
we need to grow in our knowledge we need also to explore and discover more because if you are going to dig deeper and master the master guide program it's really a very very nice program it's because our missionary field is not just in one place it's all over the world amori ana kung magkita ang iban nga mga master guides sa iban nga countries or sa iban nga mga uh, lugar what we always remember is our emblem especially our globe our our world our it's about our mission field no it's to spread the good news of salvation all throughout the world and of course ang aton nga octagon because the shape ang shape sa aton nga uh, emblem is octagon unlike the pathfinder it's an inverted triangle ang octagon is our it is the multi facets okay multi facets ang iban karian kato abinanda it's about the pathfinder uh, law ko no but it's not um, octagon means it means nga it is possible that the use of an octagon and the master guide emblem resides in its multi facets or sides the master guide program involves knowledge in many areas in order to resolve multiple challenges and problems for help saving and serving others okay so it doesn't mean nga, of course tanan at a pledge at a law we are multiplied all over the world and sa duro nga ex, duro ang explanation about sa shape ng octagon eh. uh, sometimes it's about uh, spreading it's almost a perfect circle diba ang octagon but what it means is that we are we need to be adjusting to all parts of the program hindi nga dapat flexible kita from the word uh, multi no uh, hindi natin makaya nga kita lang gid sara in running the program that is why we need to uh, expand and more and spread out no we could, we are going in our unit 2 ga uh, aten rian nga i uh, break down into pieces kung ano ang aten nga ginamin sa aten nga octagon okay so amuri a ang aten nga uh, emblem sa aten nga master guide uh, logo no so i hope uh, you were able to uh, remember these things, especially kung ano ang mga meanings sa mga emblems. Thank you very much.